All right, y'all, I'm about to finally go to Starbucks. I'm gonna go get one of the fall drinks. I'm gonna get the iced version today because nice and sunny. And you know, I haven't had an iced version in so long. So yeah, we gonna get icy. Let's go, I'm just waiting for my phone to charge, bro. My phone always be dead for some reason, bro. Like I charge it to like 15% and I take it off charge. That might say something about me. I might got like a little phone addiction going on, bro. But y'all wondering what I'm wearing right now, bro. Some slight stuff, nice little, this is what I call my fall outfit right here. Got the little sweat action, little Adidas. Fun fact about this, Adidas, but a zipper is broken, bro. Like, there's no zipper on here, bro. I broke the zipper. So, I can only wear this like this. Also, I'm not gonna go to the, the close Starbucks. I'm go to the little farther one. And you're probably wondering, why are you uh, driving farther away to go to a Starbucks? Because, bro, sometimes as a man, I feel like, you know, you just wanna like drive. And I be stuck inside my house all day, I ain't gonna lie. Like, cause now I don't even go to the gym. Like, I just work out outside. I'm gonna go for a nice little drive, bro. You know what I'm saying? See what's up. Might, might even go somewhere after. I don't know, we'll see what happens. But let's go get this coffee first, bro. Let's go get this new fall Starbucks coffee. So right now, y'all, I'm just quickly taking a peek at the menu because I don't like showing up to anywhere without like knowing what I'm gonna get. So this is the drink I'm finna get. I'm gonna get this right here. The iced pecan oat, iced pecan crunch oat latte. I'm gonna get that. And then I'm also, I'm finna get this too, bro. Cause I might as well, might as well like hit two birds with one stone. I don't know if y'all can read that properly, but it's the pumpkin cream cheese muffin. <sighs> the shit sound nasty as hell, bro. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, but you know, fuck it, bro. Fuck it, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get both things, bro. And you know Starbucks, bro. Starbucks, they be charging, bro. They be charging, like, heavy. Like, there's no joke. Like, Peaks always says, they be charging for the feature in it. <laughs> Shout out Peaks, bro. The Peaks low-key my motivation to do these videos, bro. Because, like, he don't be, like, he really does not be doing too much extra shit in his videos. Like, he just keep that shit what it is. And, you know, he don't be faking his personality or nothing. So, I fuck with Peace, bro. So, Peace, probably never gonna see this, bro. But shout out you, bro. Because, you know, your vlogs and, like, your food shit really motivate me to, like, actually do this stuff, too. So, I appreciate you putting out your content and whatnot, bro. So, but let's go. My mom want a banana bread. So, you already know. We about to run up a, a bag in the motherfucking Starbucks drive through bro. Guys, if you don't know, bro, my mom... She started making these uh, samosa for people at her work. She's trying to open up a Tiffin service. So I'm gonna keep y'all updated on this. But as you can see, bro, these samosa right here, they're all homemade samosa, bro. Like all the filling, homemade, the dough, everything. It gets fried in this fresh oil. The sauce, the sauce is homemade too, bro. So once this is like live, and if y'all in the area, we gonna let you know like what the number is and stuff on how to order. As you can see, bro, this is like, she got her own little small business going. So if y'all trying to support small businesses, you gotta support my mother. Look, y'all. Right here. The samosa, this is the dough for the samosa right here. It's like a whole, whole business in this house. Bro, you already know, anytime I'm going anywhere nowadays, I put the Crocs on. <sighs> the good thing about this camera, y'all, is that I could take it off of the stand that it's on right now and like then I could place it on the top of my car right here. So if y'all want like me to do a video on what I record on and stuff, let me know. I'll do that for y'all. But yeah, let's go get this Starbucks, bro. This is what I'm talking about right here. So this right here, like it's usually mounted to the bottom of my camera. Like I can zoom in with this shit. It make it hella easy to record on this, but like without the stand, I could really like place my cam up here and stuff. But yeah. It's, I got a solid setup going on, bro. I be making excuses not to make videos and stuff, but I really should be uploading more and like doing more things. Cause like, this is what I really like to do. I was just going about it the wrong way before, bro. I was just trying to like be somebody that I'm not. And I was trying to uh, please the masses. And when you're trying to please the masses, bro, you gonna lose yourself. Yeah, you don't gotta do too much. Just be yourself and people fuck with you. They fuck with you. If not, fuck them. All right, so I'm currently waiting in the drive-thru as y'all can see this is the starbucks that i'm fucking at that's the menu right there let me zoom in bro all right what can i get for you today uh could i please get the uh iced pecan crunch oat latte i'm sorry that was just an iced pecan crunch yeah like a grande yeah, what size is that uh could i get a grande please grande one for sure anything else for you today and then could i get that uh pumpkin cream cheese muffin yeah, just let me check if we have any left. Okay. 
Yeah, and then just one uh, banana bread, please. And a banana bread? Do you yeah. have that warmed up? Uh, yes, please. Uh, anything else we need to do? Uh, that'll be all. All right, we'll see you at the window. Thank you. All right, thankfully they had what we needed. I set this camera up. All right, y'all, so I got the stuff, bruh. You feel me? The drive through as y'all know, it took a minute, but I got it. It's right here. Uh, this is the, right here, as you can see, bro. This is the iced grande pecan oat crunch latte. Off of first impressions, bro, I don't know if y'all can see this shit properly, but it looks really fucking good, right? The drive through took hella long. Bro, that shit almost just spilled. The lid was not on. That would have been a catastrophe. I grabbed it like this, and it almost spilled everywhere in my car. No bullshit. And then... Y'all, I got this pumpkin cream cheese. Bro, I got a pumpkin cream cheese lot. Uh, I said pumpkin cream cheese latte, bro. I got a pumpkin. Bro, this shit need to move. I got a pumpkin cream cheese muffin, bro. So there's cream cheese in the muffin, bro. That shit look fucking crazy. So I'm going to try this shit first. I'm going to try the drink first, y'all. They didn't give me any napkins. The dude was a W fucking person, though. He was, like, asking me how my day is and shit, bro. When somebody asks you how your day is, you know, they're either doing it because of customer service reasons or because they're genuinely asking. I think that dude was genuinely asking, bro. I don't know. I had good energy. Anyways, let's try this right here, bro. Iced grande pecan oat latte. Hold on. Off of the first two sips, guys, I'm not gonna lie. This does taste really fucking good. Like, it does taste good. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I, I, my coffee order is just like, a, I usually just get like a regular coffee. But this right here, this is really fucking good, bro. Like, it's not too sweet, and it's not too on the opposite end too, which is like bitter. Like it's like a right balance. Like it's it, it's like it's like what you are expecting to get is exactly that flavor. Like you have the pecan flavor in there. You can taste the coffee, and it's not like bad coffee. It's good coffee, bro. Nah, bro. I don't know if I'm tasting all the sweet cream though, because as y'all see, like it's all white up here and all the brown stuff down there. Hold on. Let me like forcefully get to the brown. Let me mix it a little bit, bro. I don't know if I'm getting I think I might just be drinking sweet cream. Nah, that's hitting. This right here is an 8 out of 10 drink, bro. I'm not even lying. Like, it's actually, it's, it's good, bro. It's not bad. Now I'm going to try this fucking pecan uh, pumpkin crunch uh, muffin, bro, with cream cheese in it. It's got everything in it, bro. So I'm going to try that right now. As y'all see, the cream cheese is in the middle. I'm going to try getting a bite so I can get the cream cheese, bro. So the muffin is nice and warm. I asked him to warm it though. The cream cheese is not too strong. Like there's not too much cream cheese in the muffin as y'all see. It's like bread and like a little bit of cream cheese. There's like little uh, nuts on the top, which is like, they, they're good, no ditty. And the muffin tastes fresh. Like it doesn't taste like it's been sitting there overnight. Like you know how you go to some places, like some coffee shops, and I feel like the donuts have been sitting overnight and they're stale. This is not stale. Let me get another bite. Bro. It's a good muffin. This is a good muffin. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give this muffin like a like a 7.3 out of 10. Because it's not a bad muffin, bro. Like, it does taste really good. Like, I would... If this is the only muffin that ha was at the shop at Starbucks, I would not be mad. Like, I would get the muffin. I would not be mad. Let me know what kind of things y'all want me to try, bro. I've been thinking about doing, like, that Balkan breakfast I've been seeing on TikTok a lot. I mean, it's just bread and vegetables, but I don't know. It's the dude that be eating it make it look mad good. But anyways, I'm going to go now. I'm sat in a fucking Lord Co. Public uh, parking lot. People probably think I'm fucking crazy, bro. Like, look, look at where I'm sat, y'all, making this video. I'm fucking sat 
in a Lord Co. fucking parking lot making this fucking Starbucks review, bro. I would actually get this drink again, bro. And I did say if the drink tastes good that I would try the other drinks. Bro, that and, and the reason I think it tastes good is because of the blonde espresso. Every time I get a coffee, I usually get dark espresso, but the blonde espresso, bro, it's hidden, bro. Like, apparently, the lighter the roast, the stronger the coffee, and I think that's why this drink does so good, because it's got a, it's got a light, ro light roast and that, that, that creamy stuff on top. Pause. The Grande Pecan Oat Latte, bro. Nah, that shit good as hell. Now that I've done the Starbucks little fall review, I might have to try the Tim Hortons fall review. Let me know if y'all want to see a Tim Hortons fall review, bro. I might do that. They probably got some like fall themed donuts and stuff in there. And they probably got some like other fall drinks. So I might do that next. Let me know. But I'm going to see y'all on the next one, bro. All right, y'all be safe.